If you think we finna cancel our fucking sense and the show for a nigga sucker punching me, the fuck you got going on? <laughs> we lit tonight, bitch. Stop hanging. Listen, I'm still in Cali. I want all the smoke. Come to my show. I'm in mean, your motherfucking state. I want all the pressure. Come knock me the fuck out. Again, let's have a repeat. All right? For anybody asking me how I feel, though, I feel straight. In the end of the day, this is the life I love. Nigga finally caught me lacking. And it was about time. Bitch, I, I was, what, 5-0? Oh? <laughs> Shit. About fucking time, a nigga knocked me the fuck out. Anybody talking about it was that pussy boy artist. Just so you know, it was some gay niggas from San Diego, some affiliates that snuck in through the side, paid security off so they could come in, snuff me out, and then thought they was going to jump me, but we was too deep. So, you guys are enraged by some of the new fans. Um, I don't mean to be offensive at all when I say this. If you're not a, like, a very, very, like, updated listener as to, as to what I, what I'm dropping or don't know my lyrics or don't study my music, please don't come to the shows because then it makes it very inconvenient. Like, I saw, like, of course, like, I appreciate the support, but if you're gonna come to my shows, know my shit. If you're gonna message me and, and call yourself a fan, know my shit. Um... I mean, that's my only complaint right now. And then, obviously, like, we, like, the whole fan base should always, like, if you see someone, like, being an asshole or being unreasonable, like, you got, I just need, like, need you guys to kind of defend me and make sure you got my back. And mainly, that's really all I, like, all I ask. I'll just keep working hard. Um, obviously, 